Hi, we are the group of Javier, Christian and Chelsea and I'm going to talk about the major square of Ocaña. There was another square in the beginning with wooden porticos where bullfights, jousts and tournaments were held. Since the 16th century they want to build a large square but they started in the 18th century more or less in 1792 during the reign of Carlos III, corresponds to the period of the Neoclassicism. The first ficate they built was the West Ficate. Since 1781, when the West, North and South Ficates were finished, they stopped building the square for a century and a half. This had a barrier of trace because in this period in Spain architecture was very important open space so they were made long and large buildings such as squares in the middle of the city or castles. In the War of Independence and in the Battle of Ocaña between the French and the Spanish, a French commander bombarded the West Ficate destroying most of the historical documentary archive. In 1961, they finished the square on the occasion of the coronal coronation of the patron saint of Ocaña. In 1969, the square was paved with forming large causes, and in 1986, the West Picade was restored and attached lanterns were installed. In 1987, a huge street lamp is located in the center of the major square. In the 18th of June of 2002, it was declared a ascent of cultural interest with the category of historical site and in the 31 of May of 2006, after six years reforming the ficates, pillars and arch, they put new lighting and removed the street light that was in the center, which moved to a nearby square. Finally, the square ends at begin rectangular, with 18 arches in its longest ficates and 17 in the shortest. These are support on stone pillars of ashlar masonry, in which they load arches of half point of bridge forming porticos or galleries covered by the construction of two floors in which there are balconies and upper gators where the main streets of Ocaña come together.